your local weather authority with meteorologist Julie Hendricks. Well, good morning. It is a colder start to the day today. Over the past 24 hours, from yesterday to today where we are, you can see around 15 degrees colder as this morning begins. So we're sitting currently in a lot of locations in the teens, 14 in Paris, 18 out, in the air, out at the airport in Terre Haute, 19 in Robinson right now. Little warmer down to the south where you sit in the 20s, but with the wind factored in, at times, it feels colder for everybody. Those winds are going to be coming in out of the south. So at the same time, they're adding a chill this morning and making it feel like in some places the single digits. Those southerly winds will also help to build temperatures throughout the day. So it's kind of a double-edged sword with the way we are today with these winds. And these winds are going to pick up speed today. So we'll get wind gusts. Uh, could see wind gusts up to 35, 38 miles per hour today. Tomorrow, breezy as well once again. Even as we get into Saturday, it's going to be those southerly winds. So tomorrow is actually going to be a very mild day. There is a boundary that it's going to bring a changing wind direction for us from Saturday into Sunday. There's going to be a noticeable difference in how it feels. Right now, off to the north of us, there's a weak little disturbance coming down through the Great Lakes. This is what's going to quickly increase our cloud cover today. We got breaks overnight, so right now we do have some clearing spots out there this morning, but these clouds are going to come in. I don't really think a lot of precipitation is going to come in. We're now drier air at the surface, and so a lot of this is going to evaporate before it actually reaches the ground. Still, today, a snowflake or two in the air off to the north, a sprinkle or two to the south cannot be completely ruled out. It's not likely. Tomorrow, we'll be increasing those clouds again and increasing our chances late Saturday night into early Sunday. I think we have a better opportunity of maybe seeing a little bit of light rain falling out there. And I do mean light. Over the next 48 hours, what you see here are totals that amount to hardly anything at all. Maybe a ten to a quarter of an inch between now and the time any precip chances end as we get into Sunday. So this isn't going to be big today and it isn't going to be big tomorrow. It's just going to kind of keep us gray. And then the story becomes temperature changes. Once we get through tomorrow, temperatures start to fall on Sunday and they'll stay cold as we wrap up January and start February. It's a below normal pattern that we're going to be in. So for today, again, we are starting the day much colder, so prepare yourself for that. Temperatures today, though, will warm to around 40 degrees. Clouds will be increasing, and those winds, again, helping to bring up the warmer air, but adding a chill at the same time. Tomorrow morning, not as cold as this morning, down to near the freezing mark. And on Saturday, because we start 10 degrees warmer, we end up close to 50 degrees for Saturday afternoon. Clouds will start to increase. Could see some rain Saturday night or early Sunday. Still not bad Sunday temperature-wise but the cold air set to follow. As you see next week, temperatures don't get above freezing and those overnight lows in the teens going to be real common next week. All right.